All right, guys, there's a little bit of a theme developing. I play one game on on camera and show you and I lose. I try to speak at the same time as playing. And then I play another game off camera to recover the rating. And then I win. So I'm going to show you now the game I've just played and then we're going to get into another live game on the road to 2000. Uh, yeah, but here's me hitting a new all-time high, 1975 now. We're cruising up. I'm feeling good. This one, however, was a bit of a grisly win. Um, I got Karakhan. They play this move, which I fear. It's a horrible move. Um, if you take, you can't develop your dark square bishop. And things can become very awkward. Um, so I elected to just try and develop instead. They take and I recapture. And I don't like this because I've got a bit of a backwards pawn on the open line. So at some point I want to resolve that. Uh, so just developing now. Queen hitting this square and castles. And now I've got this pawn weakness. And maybe I'm going to play for this or this. Uh, get rid of these backwards pawns. Uh, but I line up against this knight. Often when they've pushed this pawn, it is a slight threat to take this knight. Just because you're making him take away from the center. And often this pawn's really weak on this square. So I break in the center thinking if takes, 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 queen takes, I win the queen. So even though it doesn't look like I can play this move, I think I just about can. Um, but the engine didn't love any of this. <laughs> but yeah, so they castle, and I've got a load of pressure on this on this uh, knight. So I take, and then hit the queen in between. And now here you can see my queen's looking a little bit trapped. Um, so I think I've got to probably escape with the queen. But then the bishop's hanging, so I've got to protect the bishop. So I do so, and then queen is hit. Take a pawn, queen's hit again. Queen's hit again. And all I can think to do here, guys, when your queen is completely trapped, the only option you have is try some sort of danger levels. Um, I'd love to attack his king. I can't. So I can attack his queen, though. I, I thought about this. I thought about this move. I thought about this move as well. So if he takes, I take. If this, he just takes the bishop. If this, he just goes takes, takes, and then... Knight takes bishop at the end. So I thought this maybe gave me the most chances of counterplay. So I went for that. Lost my queen, take his. He throws in the in-between move check, though, so his bishop's not hanging. And he's completely won here. Um, but somehow, guys, I, I find a swindle. Uh, here, it's a bit awkward. I'd love to move the king up. But you're just going to step into alignment issues, I think. So I retreat the king. He offers a trade. I take. And then I find this juicy move. Let me know if you see it, guys. Um, a little sacrifice here. Rook takes to get the fork. So I'm giving up a rook to win two minor pieces, which is normally really good. But I'm still slightly lost here. Um, and I'll just quickly whiz through the end game. So we want to get into a game. Uh, and this is what happened. Uh, I try to push some pawns. This pawn is, is just vile. Uh, there's no stop in it. But I've got this sort of, <laughs> I don't want to call it a fortress, because obviously I'm completely lost. But, you know, after king here, knight holds pawn, king holds everything else. It, you know, it, it, it's, it's a bad fortress, right? And here, any king move, if king takes, there's a fork. If king moves, there's a fork. So you've got to move your queen here, I think. Uh, but yeah, my opponent falls into a fork and we pick up the win. Not the cleanest, guys. But anyway, that takes me to a new all-time high, 1975. Let's get to another 10-minute game. Sip of coffee and see if we can push these highs. I'm going to try not to talk because that seems to be my downfall recently. Why does bishop go here? I mean, his pawns are on light square, so maybe my bishop's not too good. Do I trade it off? No, I think I just go here, right? Castle. Where's my dark square bishop going? Pinning? I need to smash the center. He's, yeah, he's...
this if it takes it takes I think I immediately start trying to pressure him just because he's a little bit slower in development here this if back I mean do I just go for it guys uh I'm going to go for it. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is right, but um, I mean, this takes. So this, I can just take the bishop, but then rook opens up. Um, but this to play this looks quite nice. Pretending to attack the bishop, but really I'm trying to introduce my rook to the game. Like that. And I've got sort of space advantage here. I know it looks like my king's a bit vulnerable, but I don't know. Can I ever kick the knight? This is maybe a good move, but maybe I push in. Because I've got the space advantage. If I keep it closed, maybe I'm better. I don't know what my dark square bishop's doing. But now this, this, this would trap the bishop, actually. Wow. If takes, takes, then the knight would be hit as well as the bishop. Takes, takes. Bishop here. Take, take. Queen takes. So I'm threatening to trap the bishop. It's a common theme when, when pushing pawns up the board. I think he's taking some time to consider this now. So if this, if takes, takes. Queen could take. Do I care? I take the bishop. This, this, this. Bishop takes, rook takes. Oh, I don't see an issue with this. Here, uh, this, 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 this. I don't care. I'm going for it, guys. Okay, but if queen takes, I don't really care, do I? This is here. Has he got a repetition? If this... Wait. Here, here. This, 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 this. He's got a repetition, but if I throw in this move... <laughs> there we go guys look at that move what a sexy sexy move wait has he got a check no <laughs> that is such a good looking move hitting the queen so he's not got a repetition developing a piece danger levels that is lovely and then I can take the piece it's also skewering you know, I'm, if I'm going to be up a piece here, I'm happy to skewer and, uh, in fact, where's your queen? Is your queen just trapped? The queen's just trapped. Not going to lie, guys, I did not calculate that at all. It didn't matter. I, I didn't need to trap the queen. I just kick the queen and win the piece and I'm up a piece, you know. But the fact that the queen's trapped, <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, I don't see any complications. There's no check. There's no, there's no check here. This. I'll enjoy a sip of my coffee as I hit. What is it? 1982. Hopefully. I mean, he's thinking, but there's a resignation. There we go. And that should be a pretty accurate game, I think. Let's have a quick look. <laughs> There's a new all time high, guys. Like three more wins, and I'm there. 95% accuracy. Um, I'll just. Yeah, look at that. I'm not sure if it was accurate to kick the bishop so much, but. I felt like because he hadn't castled. Yeah, the engine didn't like it, but 
still. I think the fact I'm trying to open up the board, play for this and this, even if it didn't trap the bishop, it's still trying to open up his king. It felt kind of right. Yeah. We like that, guys. Like and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Roots 2000. Yeah.